Okay, today I'm going to be talking about this gold plated Maru that I got at uh, the DeVry Open. Um, it's a Maru 3x3. It is DIY. It has a blue core and it's plated with like a gold color. And the reason I decided to do this review is because I saw someone said that it sucked. And when I first got it, it sucked big time. But I lubed it and now it is quite good. I like it better than this Edison that I just got. Um, it's not quite as fast as the regular Maru in black. But it is, I messed that up. But it is quite good. It's light, it's fast, um, cuts corners, not great, but good enough. The only thing I don't like about it is the, you know, the colors and stuff, but it, it is, it is solvable, I guess. The demonstration of the colors. Um hard to solve speed solving just it's just hard to find pieces but as far as turning quality it is quite good it's very fast um, it does lock up a little bit but it's so fun that I don't really mind and I don't use this for speed solving anyways um, what else can I say about it um, so yes I, I do think it's it turns well that's all about that's about all I can say and as far as what I lubed it with, um, it was none of those. I lubed it with um, diff oil, high viscosity silicone. Diff oil is kind of like shock oil, except this shock oil is 25 weight, this is 30,000, so it's thick. And uh, I lubed the core, I lubed the springs and washers. Uh, and then I put one drop in, same like you would do with Lubix, and just worked it in. So, I don't know, maybe maybe the gold plating helps it have low friction or something, but really the black one is just as good. And so, the problem I have is they overshoot because they're so fast, and then, then I get lockups and stuff, but I, I do like having it, it's, it's fun. I don't know, I didn't buy this, it was given to me as a prize or whatever for organizing the event, but um, I do think it turns well.